Hello, and welcome to a special episode of Poke Openings. Although, every episode of Poke Openings is special because you're watching it. Uh, so, today, I went to a uh, local comic and gaming convention recently, and, of course, uh, I bought some Pokemon cards because it, it's hard to go anywhere without buying any Pokemon cards. So, as you can see, I've bought a couple packs. It's not going to be a crazy video today. But I just thought it would be interesting to open, because uh, these are kind of special packs, I think. Before we get started as well, I did also buy this pretty cool thing, which is a 2000s uh, Pokemon League promo. Uh, so this um, has the Mew kind of promotion thing there, and uh, it's apparently Electabuzz. Uh, the back, it's sealed. don't know if you can really, uh, you can kind of see there, it's in a top loader. So I'm just going to keep this here, but I, I thought it was pretty cool. I do love old adverts for like Pokemon events that aren't going on anymore. So this is a little bit of history as well, but uh, this isn't Japanese and I'm not going to open it. But I just thought I'd show you guys, uh, you know, it's, it's a nice little thing to chuck in the collection. So today we've got five packs. So as you can see, we have a 25th anniversary collection. We have one pack of VMAX Climax. And we have three packs of Dream League. So I just kind of picked up a mishmash of things, really. So what I'm thinking is we'll start with VMAX, go into Dream League, and end with the 25th anniversary. So obviously in Japan they do things a little bit different. So if you are new to Japanese cards, you know, these might be a bit strange. Now this, I'm pretty sure, unfortunately I can't read kanji, but I'm pretty sure... Um, there's a guaranteed SR, because obviously their rarities are different than ours over here. Now, I'm going to use a scissors for this, because the pack is so nice that if I just rip down, it'll be, like, cutting a lot of it. So, um, I want to say this is one of the, like, hype packs that a lot of people on YouTube and stuff have opened. <laughs> Imagine that, making a video on YouTube but opening up Pokemon cards. What kind of loser would do that? Right, okay, I didn't cut that very well. I've still got some... Ooh, ooh, that opened kind of nice, actually. You know what? I'll give myself credit for that. That was completely planned. Also, I love the pack. Just like the art and stuff. Obviously, it's very uh, sword and shield base. We've got best girl there. So I don't know what exactly the chances are. I don't know the card trick or anything. There's a decent few cards here. Oh, man. So... Put the pack to the back. The back, the back of these cards in Japanese is just, it's something else. Like, I love it. So right, uh, as I say, I don't know what the deal is with these packs. I think you guarantee the VMAX and maybe like a hollow as well or something. I mean, we're starting with a reverse energy. I'm guessing maybe that's guaranteed every pack. I don't know, but uh, very nice, so. Ooh, we have a uh, Dengeki, no, uh, Chigeki, uh, Ichigeki, sorry, uh, Houndo. Very nice. So this is, uh, yeah, I, I suppose this is battle styles, right? We've got Inke. I am going to obviously just be calling them by their English names. Uh, we've got Marip or Meripu. Meripu, so Marip isn't... That different. Also, I love the borders, the Japanese ones. They're all like silvery and stuff. Ooh, I can't remember the name of this. This is Powerful Energy or Powerfuru Energy. Very nice. Hey, we've got Toritsukai. Uh, Tori obviously is bird, so that's a bird keeper, right? Bird keeper, bird trainer. I do believe this is Memory Capsule or Memory Kapuseru. Very nice. Ooh, hoo hoo, yo. Okay, so this is reverse, I think. Um, yeah, so I think these are like Japanese reverses. We've got Leon. Good Lord, dude. Okay, that. God, this is so much cooler than like English reverses. Uh, I think this is reverse. Anyway, maybe this is like a rare, but yo, okay. Next up, yo, we've got a Frozmoth. Look at that. That is very nice as well. That's, uh, man, the background as well. I don't know what it is about the, maybe like these are super special hollows or whatever. But that's, that's really cute. I don't think I've seen that Frozmoth either. 
Maybe I've just not pulled it, but like, yeah. And our VMAX. Yo, Duraldon. Very. Oh, wait, there's something behind it as well. Yo. Okay, God, that's super shiny. That's like. That's insane shininess. Man, this pack was worth it. They are a little bit pricey, admittedly, because these are Japanese products. You can't get them in the West quite as easy, but. Uh, Dude, okay, and our last card. Ah, is a Flareon, and it's got the kind of rainbow hollow effect. Now, I've opened some Card Fight Vanguard before they have this effect. Uh, I'm sure there is, like, you know, a name for it or whatever, but yeah, yo, that's like four shiny cards, man. This, this pack was worth it. This is really cool. Now, obviously, I don't know, you know, th there's probably some, like, super hype cards in here, or, like, full arts and stuff like that. I'm, I'm sure, you know, maybe I didn't get some crazy, crazy pulls, but I, I'm very happy with that. That that turned out, uh, you know, pretty pretty good. And that, that was quite a lot of cards as well. That was, like, similar to a standard uh, Western one. It was, like, ten cards, I think it was. That's pretty cool. Right. Next up, we've got Dream League, or Dream League. Uh, so this, um, not sure exactly. So this has five cards in it. Not sure exactly. I think this is, oh wait, no, this is Team Up GX. Yeah, there we go, All right. So, uh, sorry, Tag Team GX. Very nice. I saw this because, like, I do like the Tag Team cards. They're just, like, super cool anyway. And I was like, well, this is roughly the same price as, like, Two with the other sets, so I was like, eh, you know what, why not? Again, I really love the pack art, we got Lily, uh, and, I mean, we've got your boy N, and Red, obviously, I mean, some fan favourites there, they, they know what they're doing with this one, so, five cards, I don't think you guaranteed anything with Dream League, but I got three packs, I mean, I'm not, I'm not holding out hope for a team up, but, you never know. So, again, try to cut that and open it normally. Uh, please open. There we go. Right then. So, let's begin. Okay, we got a dupe bidder. Very nice. Hey, we've got a gloom. Just like really chilling there. That's, it's very cute. That I don't recognise that gloom either. But again, these could be like a while ago, so it might just be that I'm not recognising them. We've got a Ralts, very cute Ralts. Man, these borders, just like, they make them look so cool. Hey, we have a Yakon. Okay, so that's Clay's name in uh, Jap Japanese, Yakon. Very nice. And, okay, we've got a regular Macargo. Not bad though, he's, look at him, he's a happy little fire snail. Right, still two packs to go, so um, also a fun fact and a shout out to a friend of the channel and a member of Talk Toys, Tom, uh, he did buy a Unified Minds uh, and, oh I can't remember the other one but they were both tag team uh, boosters, they, they were quite a bit of money and um, he did not get great pulls. So, uh, F in the chat, if you made it this far into the video, please leave an F for Tom. Uh, we we all mourn his loss. But Tim did manage to get a hollow from that pack uh, that he bought of Unified Minds. So, you know, it, it's not all bad. Right, next up, we've got a Sneasel, <laughs> followed by that same gloom again. Okay, drill, but man, it's been a while since I've seen a drill, but this is definitely an old set. Let's go. Okay, cool. Yo, okay. Kowatsu. Kowatsu. Very nice. Dude. Okay. Again, loving these hollows. Just so nice. Uh, is this... No, this is a hollow, though, right? This isn't a reverse. Okay. Uh... Oh, cool. And our rare is Itsuki. Itsuki, I can't remember her name. But we have an Itsuki. 
Okay, cool. Well, I got I got a hit. I got a hit from one of these packs. I'm I'm pretty happy. Also, like man, I just now that I can read Kana, these like these packs are a lot cooler. I find because um, everything's either in Hiragana or Katakana. At least the names are. Um, I think maybe the effects are written partly in kanji or whatever, but I mean, I'm not going to be playing these cards, am I? Uh, I'm just going to be adding them to a binder. But yeah, I don't know, there's something a little bit nostalgic about Japanese cards as well, because when I was younger, during like the height of Pokemania, if you could get your hands on like Japanese Pokemon cards, it was like really cool. I've still got a Japanese Mareep from like one of the Neo sets. That is unironically one of my favourite cards ever. Uh, anyway, we've got a time pool. Very cute. Eee, we've got a Curlia to go with that Ralts we pulled just now. Wait, was Ralts from the other set, actually? No, it is from this set. I can't remember. Ah, oh, we've got a Lillipup. Or a Co... Coteri. Coteri. Very nice. Yo, another Hollow. Let's fucking go Galid. Okay, okay, Th these have been pretty good then. I mean, look, I don't have team-ups, but pretty good. That's, uh... So I guess it's like one to the front with these, right? I guess? Ah, oh, yo, that's... that's really cool. I think I may have this in English. I can't remember. And we end with a Palpitoad. Who's, you know, Palpitoad's cool. So yeah, I guess, like, rare is the fourth slot in the pack. That's a... I'm very new to Japanese cards. Uh, I did open a few... I, feel, I opened a few at the start of XY. I think it was, like... Uh, X and Y base, I think. And there was another set. Red and blue shift or something. Anyway, we're going to end on something kind of hype as well. This is the 25th anniversary collection. Now... For those of you un unaware, when Celebrations came out over here, you had like a chance of getting one of the classic collection cards. In Japan, I think it worked slightly different in that when you bought a certain amount of classic uh, Celebrations packs, or the Japanese Celebrations packs, you'd get one of these, which I think has like... I don't know how many... Oh, it's got five cards. Okay, and maybe one of them... <laughs> Actually, yeah, no, this might just be 25th anniversary collection. This might just be the regular Japanese version of Celebrations, maybe? I mean, there were cool cards in Celebrations anyway. So, like, you know, I I thought I'd buy this just because, like, again, I'm probably not going to get another chance to get it or whatever. But, yeah, it's, uh, I did get very excited and I saw Japanese Pokemon cards. Right, well... Uh, let's begin. Ooh. Ooh, okay. This is kind of worth it already. We've got the 25th stamp on, um, on a reverse hollow fighting energy. Okay. Let's go. That's... Man, that's really cool. Okay. Man, why didn't we get the stamps? You know? Oh, they've all got stamps. Okay. Never mind then. The okay, well, th this is definitely worth it then. Yo, I'm... We got a hollow professor's research. Oh wait, they're all hollow, aren't they? <laughs> okay, never mind. Pulling a hollow isn't as crazy then, but that's professor's research, I believe. Yo, let's go. Oh man, they look so shiny. Even though I've pulled several of these before, uh, I quite like like an evil towel maybe uh, to like complete the collection. No, okay, we got Reshiram. And I'm going to say Lugia for the last one, maybe. I really like the stamps. Honestly, why why the hell didn't we get those? Oh, ooh, look at that pattern. What? What's going Hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. That doesn't have a pattern on. Why is that zoom? It's got a pattern. Look at that dude. Look at that laser pattern. Okay. Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. Wait. I just pulled the... So is there like... Is there a chance of getting one patterned version? Holy crap! That's nice! That's super nice! Okay, wow! Right, never mind then! I was... 
I was a little bit, when I realised that I wouldn't be getting any classic collections, I was like, oh, well, okay, I guess. But, yo, this is made up for it. That's nice. Okay, cool. Right. Well, there we go, then. I'm going to start looking into this laser uh, thing and getting mesmerised. Well, well, thank you guys very much for watching. Uh, it's been a lot of fun. As I say, it's just a little quick video today. But uh, stay tuned, because there will be more Pokemon cards coming soon. They'll be English, but... There will be some more cards, so um, yeah, that's it. So until next time, goodbye.